please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hi everyone, here are your hints this week. Number one, it shares a filming location with Jurassic World. Number two, is a part of this movie was filmed here in New Mexico. And number three, it is a movie and a board game. Study Tips with Emily. A common study habit for many is to repeatedly reread their notes and highlight the key points. However, studies have shown that this is ineffective. A better practice is to use flashcards. When you continually reread things, you are not challenging your brain to truly understand the concepts. When using flashcards, you are forcing your brain to actually learn about the subject in order to recall the answer and the prompted question. When you're studying, do you use flashcards? Sometimes. When you use them, does it help you remember what you studied? Yes. Thanks for watching, Raptors. Vocab Word of the Week with Lorenzo. A definition for categorize is to put into a category. A sentence for categorize is, I categorize my clothes by color so it's easy to get ready in the morning. Some synonyms for categorize are classify, group, and sort. Hey Raptors, welcome back to the JMMS Game Show. Here I have my 6th, 7th, and 8th grader, and please say your names. Peyton, Johanna, Mariah. And here will be our questions. Hey Mariah, your first question will be, name as many country artists as you can in 10 seconds. Your timer starts now. Miley Cyrus, Noah Cyrus, um, George, George, um, George Strait, um, uh, yeah. Your time's up. Um, she has a total point of six. Um, on to her next person. Your first question will be, name as many fictional movies as you can in ten seconds. Your timer starts now. Ghostbusters. Halloween Town. Time's up. She has a final of four points. That's two questions answered. And on to our final person. Okay. Your question will be, name as many continents as you can in 10 seconds. Your timer starts now. <laughs> North America, South America, um, Asia, uh, and... <laughs> okay. So you got a final points of six. That's three questions answered, which means our eighth and sixth grader have a tiebreaker. And unfortunately, our seventh, seventh grader got knocked out. So let's see you guys in the tiebreaker. Welcome back, Raptors. Here we have our eighth and sixth grader with our tiebreaker. Today we'll be doing rock, paper, scissors, uh, best out of three. Are you guys ready? Yeah, sure. All right, okay. Are you guys ready? Yes. Okay, rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock. Paper, scissors, shoot. Hey, I went that wrong. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Okay, whoever wins this one wins it all. Are you guys ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. You cheated. I, I think you that was kind of a cheat. Oh. I think that was kind of a cheat. Okay, just go. Okay, rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. 
Okay, our eighth grader has won this one. We'll see you next week, Raptors. The James Monroe 2021-2022 yearbook is finally here. Are you looking for a way to remember your friends this year? If you are, then this yearbook is for you. So buy the yearbook now. Head to, James, to the James Monroe website to order at jamesmonroe.aps.edu. See you later, Raptors.